Welcome to Worship Live. It's Friday, January 29th, and we're glad you've joined us today. It's Friday. Yay. Oh, wow. You got a mask. I have a Mickey Mouse mask. That oh is goodness. awesome. I love it. My, my. That makes people wardrobe smile. Wardrobe is growing. I guess it is. <laughs> and they seem to be coming instantaneously. I know. This is great. Yeah, it's, I wonder if they have Snoopy you. ones. I'm sure they do somewhere. Okay. So, Anne Louise, Robert needs a Snoopy mask. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> so, if you're watching today. That's Socks, great. tie, <laughs> and mask. Very good. That's hey, great. today is National Corn Chip Day. I love corn chips with chili. Yes. I'm hungry for chili. So maybe chili we'll have would be to good. have some. My mom makes vegetarian chili. Remember that? Yeah, that's really good mm, stuff. Good. We, haven't we haven't been to Wen- we haven't been to Wendy's forever either. We no, used to go true. like we were the major supporters of Wendy's chili. <laughs> is Wendy's not open? It is, but you can't eat inside. Inside, okay. Oh. Okay. Today is National Puzzle Day. I want to do a puzzle this year. I bought a puzzle. Oh, no, I didn't buy a puzzle. I said I wanted to do a puzzle. And a friend of ours, when we came home from our trip, had a box in front of the door. And um, the Spurlax. They, um, and it, it was for Carter. And it was full of family fun things to do. Well, that's cool. Yeah, it was really, really neat. And there's a puzzle in there. And I, and I even said, I, remember, I said to them that weekend, I said, I'd like to do a puzzle, <laughs> but I, I don't want to do a thousand-piece puzzle. I want to do like a 500-piece puzzle. It's an awesome puzzle, 500 pieces. I'm going to well, get it done. we should take it to Atlanta so that while I'm sleeping. I can sit and do a puzzle. While you were sleeping. While you were sleeping. <laughs> well, I'm doing puzzle. You are? Yeah, my, my grandkids bought me a Steamboat Willie Lego set with 800 that, pieces. Oh, wow. But yours is 3D, right? That's like a, it's an object Lego. you're putting together. That's a, right? Yeah, I mean, I'm that's 66 and I never, ever put Legos together. Your own Lego, that's great. <clears throat> so I'm obsessed. There's a man at our church who does that, um, the Bordens. He puts together Lego sets and then he puts them all back in the box and then he, when Carter was doing them, he'd bring them to Carter and let Carter put them together. Yeah, that's what Zach used to do. He would take them apart and he had them all categorized and really not. <laughs> but it's come in <laughs> handy up because in a big bucket <laughs> because I missed a bunch of pieces that they didn't include in the box. So I went to Zach's stash and found well, the pieces. Awesome. Yeah, so it's fun. That's Today great. is also National Big Wig Day. Or it's Big Wig Day. I can't figure out which way they Who's mean it. Who's a big it. wig? Like Bill's a well, big like wig? Bill would be a big wig. I thought it meant a big wig. Well, that's what I'm not like sure. Like Southern Gospel people. There's have two this. ways. <laughs> I remember that. when I was at Sandy Cove, there was a speaker, and I didn't know she wore wigs. And I had to deliver something to her room <laughs> while she was speaking. And when I went into the room, there were three foam heads, and they all had different wigs on. So that's funny. I think that's what I think of when I think of big wigs. <laughs> <laughs> All right, awesome. I guess we better stop fooling around. We'll get in trouble. I guess we yeah, should right? do what we came here to do. I, I uh, think people enjoy laughing. Yeah. <laughs> and we do corny really well. Yeah, you know, I often think that, um, you know, that God has a sense of humor because he created us with a sense of humor. And so when we have fun, when we enjoy um, each other and enjoy life, um, we honor him. I think we bring glory to him. We walk with him, and he is our friend. The king of all the universe loves you and me enough to want to be our friend, to listen to us, and to carry our burdens. Let's not miss out on that opportunity to take every care and concern we have, because what a friend we have in Jesus. Sins and griefs to bear. 
temptations is there trouble
tries to give me reasons why I shouldn't serve the Lord. They say don't believe it if you can't touch or see it. It must not be worth living for. But they can say what they will, because my hope is fulfilled. to say this is the only life for me and the longer I know him the more that his peace is abiding in me and my faith is deeper now than when I first believed though the past This is the only life for me. Now I am not saying that all of my days have turned out right. I have my share of trouble when life is a struggle. The sun just refuses to shine. But in my darkest hour, I find his power. He gives me the strength I need. And I'm here to say, this is the only life for me. And the longer I know him, the more that his peace is abiding. This is the only life for me. Oh, I'm here to say this is the only life for me. Well, this afternoon at 2.30, we have episode 60, can you believe it, of the Bob and Bill podcast, and David Harris is going to be singing, and we have a message from Pastor Randy Smith from Grace Bible Church. He was here to speak for our New Year's Eve event, and on New Year's Day, gave a really, really cool message, and in fact, he even talks about masks, so you don't want to miss that. You can check it out on Facebook Live, BoxCast, or YouTube. Now, the last couple of weeks have been really slow at Keswick. But we're about to move into the month of February. Yes. Uh, beginning on Monday night, we have our Pastors and Wives concert, concert <laughs> conference with Dr. Jim Ayers from Lancaster Bible College. Yep. We still have some reservations available, so if you want to check that out, it's on our website. Then we have our two hymn sings. Two hymn sings. Uh, Thursday and Friday, the theme is God's Unstoppable Love. You can make reservations for that, and it's live here on campus. Mm -hmm. You don't want to just watch it on the Internet. No, it's more it's fun being here, person. and the food is amazing. And then the next week, we have Girl Talk, and we have Men's, Men's Fellowship, Fellowship Night, Night, and then Couples. <laughs> and Lisa and Scott Mitchell are going to be here for the first time doing our Couples Weekend. They're great. They're friends of yours mm -hmm. and ours. Yep. And it's so that we have reservations available for that. We have a dinner concert then on Saturday night of Valentine's weekend yep. with Larry Ford, and it's sold out. Already? Already sold out. Wow. So you want to check out all this information on our website, www.americaskeswick.org. Come. Don't just watch stuff online. Come and be a part. You'll be really, really blessed as you come on campus and experience these great events. Hey, thanks for watching us in Worship, worship Life. Have a great weekend. 
and we look forward to seeing you back here on Monday at 1.30. God bless.